Guys, come, I wanna show you something. Three hours away from me, in that direction, there is a ship that broke and spilled oil in the ocean in Mauritius. Seven hours away from me, in that direction, there is a port in Beirut that exploded, killing 150 people in one week. Two tragedies happened. There are many reasons for them. But today, I want to focus on just one. Ships! They are more dangerous than we think. Let me explain. In today's world, if I want to own a ship, the process is too easy. First, I buy the ship. It can be old, it can be used. Then, I start a shell company. I put the ship under my company and I register the company in a foreign country that I don't live in like Panama and just like that my ship is legal I can sail in the ocean I can avoid taxes I can ship anything I want and if I don't care about safety and my ship crashes and destroys nature it's not my responsibility <laughs> it's the company's responsibility that I registered in Panama so good luck trying to sue me. This is oversimplified, but the problem is obvious. The shipping industry is unsafe. 20% of the world's ships are registered in one country, Panama. People choose Panama because it's too easy. There are not many rules. You can be anonymous. You can ship anything. You can do whatever you like. And because there's very little safety regulations, you get disasters. For example, in Mauritius, the ship was heading towards the island for many days and no one noticed. It crashed in the corals and spilled tons of oil in some of the rarest marine life in the world. The ship is owned by a Japanese company, but it's registered in Panama. No one knows yet who is going to pay for the oil spill. So for now, the locals have to clean their own beach. In Beirut, the explosive material was in another ship that was considered unsafe. So the owner left the ship in Beirut. And a few years later, the cargo exploded, killing 150 people. Don't get me wrong, I love ships. 90% of everything that we own was shipped. But this week was a wake up call. If you want to put a ship in the ocean, if you want to carry oil or bombs in our ocean, you should be responsible for it. Not your fake company in Panama or Liberia. You should not avoid taxes, hire cheap labor, and use old ships just to save money. Right now, the people of Lebanon are crying and the nature of Mauritius is dying. Let us make our oceans, ships, and ports safe for everybody. See you next week.